Meet Bicycle! Hello everybody! Welcome back to another modded weapon guide here on Borderlands 2. Today we are going to be looking at a new modded sniper rifle uh, which is highly highly accurate and very powerful. It's a semi-automatic sniper rifle um, and very very little recoil on it as well as you can see which means that you can just sit there firing as fast as you can, pull the trigger aiming for the heads, if you don't hit the heads you're still going to do a good amount of damage if you do do headshots then boom off the go, well it, off it goes really uh, so it's been made by CZR Spec 5 over on the uh, Borderlands 2 community github and uh, it's called the Ranger and uh, absolutely love this for those of you that love sniping or uh, want to get used to sniping a bit better fast firing sniping this is absolutely perfect um, obviously I'm using this on a, a melee zero um, sorry a sniping zero character which is like very highly specced into sniping so this may look a little bit overpowered but you can try this on other characters uh, and it probably will be more of a challenge to get the kills but uh, yeah anyway as always we're going to start off this guy by showing you guys exactly where to get it so as always you can click on the link in the description that will take you straight there or you can navigate there yourself by clicking on Borderlands 2 mods on the Borderlands 2 community github and then from there just scroll down ever so slightly uh, may not even need to scroll at all to CZR spec fees section that is uh, quite high up on the list and then uh, there is his list of weapons available we're going to be looking at the Ranger today so click on that that'll bring up the weapons information page with all the information you need to know as well as the code itself to apply this Click on the raw tab at the top right of the screen, right click save as, save into your Borderlands 2 binaries folder and then remember what you've saved it as and come into the game and execute it on the console command menu which is just here. You're going to need to grab yourself a legendary invader sniper rifle to turn this into the ranger and as you can see right here I have two uh, uh, different prefixes going to mainly use this longitudinal one so as you can see on the weapons overview it's got a lovely looking blue and black skin right there uh, it just looks like blue paint been uh, splashed into it it looks awesome um, it says tactical necessity as the red text and uh, yeah as you can see like I said it's a uh, fast firing sniper rifle so uh, it's semi-automatic and uh, with it being uh, Jacobs it fires as fast as you can pull the trigger so that's pretty much everything you need to know we're going to be taking this through the sniping gauntlet uh, which is my testing ground for sniper rifles here in Lynchwood whenever we get uh, sniper rifles to test out I always like to uh, come here for some reason I just like the fact that it's a nice thin little um, long viewed place where you can see enemies from far away you can test mid range close range and long range all in one go so we're just going to be running this, no, uh, you know, nothing too serious today, but uh, yeah, just enjoying popping heads from different distances. So uh, yeah, anyway, like I said, this is the uh, Ranger which replaces the Invader, and uh, it's semi-automatic, highly accurate, and just basically fires as fast as you can pull the trigger. That is basically all you need to know. It does have ammo regen on it, as you can see if you keep an eye at the bottom right of the screen. I think it's about 0. Is it 0. 0.5? Uh, 0.75 seconds something like that it does say on the weapon card um, exactly how much ammo regen you get that is very very handy uh, all ammo regen on weapons is handy anyway but uh, especially with sniper rifles not having a huge amount of ammo to carry around 220 rounds yeah, you could soon get through it uh, on a normal sniper rifle this obviously is no normal sniper rifle this is a seriously fast firing one and no matter how steady you try and play with it because you know you can fire very very many shots in a very little amount of time you do just spam click a lot I find uh, so you can soon go through a hell of a lot of ammo so uh, yeah just in between areas uh, killing a load of enemies you can use a lot of this uh, running to the next area you will find you'll get yourself you know 10 20 30 whatever rounds back while just running and not doing anything so that's always very handy uh, obviously I've got a uh, sniper rifle relic uh, equipped as well which also gives me more uh, amounts I can store on a sniper which is also very very handy so something like that would be recommended but uh, yeah definitely good to have ammo regen especially as you can see I had a full 220 or whatever rounds when I started and I am already down to nearly uh, 100 so uh, definitely recommend using that 
Uh, like I said in the beginning as well, this is very powerful on a sniping zero setup. So if you want to just go general mobbing, just trash through enemies, snipe the heads off, that kind of thing. Um, even the experienced zero players, you'll find that this is a very good weapon to use. If you're relatively new to sniping and just uh, fancy just giving it a good go and uh, not being able to be too tactical in killing enemies, just want to pop a few heads off as well, this is really good. Like I said, for those of you that don't like overpowered weapons, maybe put it on a different character and have some fun with it and try uh, testing your sniping skills out. So yes, anyway guys, that is the modded weapon guide of the Ranger, the rapid fire no nonsense slaying sniper rifle made by CZR Spec 5. Thank you guys for watching, really hope you enjoy and I'll see you in the next one.